Welcome to Crafts with Tepper. I'm Dean Steven Tepper, and I'm here with Will, who is a junior in our digital culture program, which is in the School of Art, Media, and Engineering. Nope. You always miss the S. Well, it's because, I, look, I have an S in my name, and so I have enough. Crafts with Tepper. What, what's the craft today? Oh, we're making slime. All right, so slime may not seem like one of the disciplines we teach here at the Herber Institute, but depending on our experience, we might consider it. So what is digital culture? So nobody actually knows what digital culture is. That's the... It's like the secretive major of ASU. And that is why we're number one in innovation. The reason it's so confusing is because it's a bunch of different things. It's like graphic design, coding, it's audio, it's electronic design, it's just all sorts of things. We're gonna get back to digital culture, but we gotta start making our slime. So we start with two thirds a cup of Elmer glue. Um, whose is this? It's for Oh, so this digital culture degree combines mm -hmm. like a lot of stuff? Yes, absolutely. So when did you know as a kid growing up that you were the kind of person who liked a lot of stuff. So I've always had an interest in graphic design, but then in middle school I started playing guitar. Did you have a, a family member that was forcing you into these activities or you just naturally wanted to do them? A little bit of both. It was more of an encouraging kind of yeah. vibe. My mom is an artist. Okay. Uh, she paints. Yeah. So I would draw with her as a kid. So you remember growing up and like looking at your mom's work and thinking that's yeah. pretty cool. Yeah. My dad's also an architect, so that was another like inspirational. You have no like tax attorneys, no you have like no. Nope. Okay, well I'm gonna ask you to flip that glue All right. into your bowl so that I can then measure my glue. Flip that glue, flip, flip that, that glue, glue. Flip, flip that, that glue. glue, flip that, that glue. glue. Wow. So glue seems it's like a sort of a magical thing for like a like a kid. Now I know some people abuse glue, so we're not talking about that kind of magic. No, but just like here. Elmer's glue itself. So did, have, did you ever cover your entire hand, back of your hand, with glue? Oh yeah, then, oh yeah. And then peel it off? And then peel it off? I feel like a reptile? Yeah. Oh yeah. I've kept that as a secret. I thought I was so strange as a child. <laughs> but apparently I was not. Because if you don't do that, I feel like you're gonna grow up weird. So do you remember gluing something that you shouldn't have glued when you were little? Um, glued my intestines. I think that counts. <laughs> <laughs> nope. Um, okay, now we need a half a teaspoon of baking soda. Right. There you go. If we really want to get tons of views, maybe we can do a slime uh, trick shot challenge. Ooh, that's good. I don't think that's been done before. No. So, okay, so you're a multidisciplinary artist, play the guitar, yeah. sing, mm -hmm. um, you like coding, Yeah. you okay. like drawing, mm -hmm. uh, I poured that for you. Great, thank you. We need three of these. Okay, three of them. All right, I got this. <laughs> you know what we're gonna do? Just, I, I, we're gonna use, we put food coloring until you're satisfied with the color. I like the way the instructions read. And there's a lot of freedom too. Like you can choose whatever you want. You could. Kind of like my major, digital culture. So now we know, we're doing slime. Yeah. Because digital culture is the analogical slime degree. <laughs> so you were describing mm -hmm. What you learn, what you make. Mm -hmm. So you learn a lot of coding, just so you know how to program things. Now, do you code better when you're listening to certain kinds of music? Oh. Mm. I'm not satisfied yet. I only code well yet. when I'm listening to death metal or death grips. The band. Really? Yeah. OK, I don't know uh, death grips. How much do I add? So here, I'm going to read these now slowly. I think you should always read the word slowly, slowly. Huh. So <laughs> now, slowly, slowly, add in, they could have done that, they could have edited that, but we just did it for you. You don't yeah. have to edit it now. <laughs> the slime will be very sticky when you're kneading, and that is normal. Okay, but because you're a digital culture student, you are not looking for normal. No. Okay, should I mix in my dye though first? Yeah, that's what I have done. Yes. Okay. Wait, could I shave with this now? Um, I, would, <laughs> I would recommend that. 
Yeah. Yeah. The idea that you can just experiment with things without necessarily knowing what the outcome's going to be. Yeah. That's kind of a, 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 the spirit of digital culture. But the great thing about digital culture is you do you learn so many different skills. Right. Basically, whatever classes you want to take that are related to digital culture, you can take. So do you know that we're launching in the fall a new popular music degree? Oh, really? I did not know that. And we built uh, this extraordinary uh, performance and uh, recording and studio space in downtown oh. Phoenix. Okay, so I kind of want to try something. Yes. I'm, I'm all, I'm, okay. I'm, you want to? Yeah, so I think your slime is great. And my slime is great. I'm kind of curious to see what happens. If we... If... Okay, let's do it. Yeah. So what's your favorite action character of all time? Action character of all time? Okay, so it's either Neo from The Matrix or Arnold Schwarzenegger from The Terminator. We got where... purple. Yeah. Purple. 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 Well, but I don't actually don't... I think it's purple. Although I am not know. kind of... Oh, how do you so know? I also, <laughs> I also, just speaking of gut, my ninth grade science fair project was about medical illustration. Mm. So I dissected a frog. It was great, except I, I misspelled on the poster the word muscle. And the girl that I liked, so uh, Carol Brady, <laughs> uh, if you're, if you're, out if you're there. watching this, <laughs> her mother came up to me and corrected the spelling. She said, oh, this, is, this is great, you know, you really drew the frog, it's very vivid, it's very realistic, but you know, you need to learn how to spell muscle. But look where you are now. Here I am. Rocking it with the bow tie and everything. Dean of slime. <laughs> um, I gotta do the, the money shot, look at that. How would you rate both the action and the story of this Crafts with Tepper? Mm. <laughs> the action, I mean, there's a lot of action. I agree with that. Like, look at this. Mm. Oh. <laughs> yes. <laughs> this is a perfect episode. Maybe even our best. Yes. I think this will be our best. Kids who are out there watching because you like watching things about slime, feast your eyes. Slime is just the delivery mechanism. Yeah. What we really want you to do is come here and study this extraordinary major where you can do anything, build anything, make anything, dream anything, make it happen. Well, thank you for participating in Crafts with Tepper. Um, let's thank do you. it. And uh, good luck in your senior year. Thank you, appreciate and it. And I cannot wait to, uh, to hand you your diploma uh, a little over a year from now. And don't be surprised if there's just a little tiny bit of slime on the back of it. <laughs> I'm looking forward to it. All right. Crass with the Dean.